Guan Yu, god of war, fell at my castle. As promised, Sun Quan receives a large portion of Jing province for cooperating with Cao Cao. However, the cost of breaking the alliance with Shu and killing Liu Bei's sworn brother would not be small. With the alliance gone, the united stance against Wei fell apart. Elsewhere, having witnessed the changes he had planned, Cao Cao quietly drew his last breath. He entrusted the future to his son, Cao Pi. The world of the Three Kingdoms was about to enter a new phase. I am a total disgrace. I was totally oblivious to our Lord's condition. In the end, I never repaid the debt I owed him. Chiu, you are not the only one who feels down. My father's death has shaken the core of the very land itself. However, if we do not overcome this grief, all of Cao Cao's efforts will have been for nothing. And as his children, we must set an example for others. Yes, you're right. I'm an important member of the Cao family. In times like these, I must try harder than everybody else. I apologize for showing such weakness. I promise to serve you with every fiber of my being, Master Cao Pi. Indeed, your honesty is your greatest strength. I am counting on you immensely. Master Cao Pi, the Emperor has issued a decree naming you the King of Wei. The King of Wei? So, he wishes me to follow in my father's footsteps. However, that is not enough to satisfy my ambition. I shall reach the heights achieved by my father, or should I say, I shall surpass him. Surpass him? What do you mean by that? In other words, you wish to become emperor, Master Cao Pi? It is the most logical decision if I am to make way even stronger, and bring peace to the land. I see. While I am sure you'll face opposition, it should not be anything we can't handle. Do you wish to make your move right away? Yes, but we must follow the proper procedure and force him to abdicate. Only then can I begin to create a new world of my own design. It seems that the Han Imperial Court is about to meet its end. Shh! You mustn't say things like that out loud. If one of the Cao family were to hear you! Did you hear the news? Lord Cao Pi is about to be named Emperor! Huh? What about the current Emperor? D don't tell me that they... I heard that Lord Cao Pi said the Emperor wishes to abdicate the throne voluntarily. That's ridiculous! Why would he just give up the throne like that? Lord Cao Pi must be applying pressure to him. So that means he's forcing the Emperor to abdicate just to deflect suspicion of his intentions? If so, Lord Cao Pi is one terrifying individual. I agree. He's like the worst kind of villain.
Master Cao Pi, the stage preparations are complete. The stage. So this is where the Emperor will abdicate the throne and transfer authority to me. This ceremony should serve as a fitting end to the Han and herald the birth of the Wei Emperor. My lord, it appears that the faction supporting the Emperor has begun to step up their activities. It seems there is somebody behind the scenes looking to incite them. If we proceed with the abdication now, it is only likely to invite further violence. We must deal with this immediately. You're right, Sima Yi. If Wei is to create a new age of stability for the land, we must eliminate any who oppose my ascension. Relations between Wu and Shu are strained due to Guan Yu's death. This is our chance to solidify our power. Do whatever you can to expedite the process. Sure. Obstruct my ascension to the throne. Do not look past any detail no matter how trivial it may seem. I have heard unsettling rumors that people close to the Emperor are planning to attack Master Cao Pi's residence. As long as I'm around, I refuse to let anybody attack our lord. I shall serve as the shield that protects our home from harm. We must fight to defend our lord! Defeat the brigand, Salpi! Things turned out rather nicely. Your skills are simply magnificent!
I cannot believe the rumors I am hearing in Luoyang. Could Master Cao Pi really be plotting to assassinate the Emperor? That sounds like the rumor being spread by the Shu spy. We can't let this go any further. We must find the spy and shut him up. I've heard some nasty rumors. From that person over there, actually. There was a suspicious person here. They headed off cautiously down that path. Based on the information we've obtained so far, hmm, I have a feeling the spy is over there. Based on the information I have obtained so far, I anticipate Shu's spies to be in that area there. Spotted, but I won't let you catch me. I'm deadly soon. Spreading any rumors now. I'll have to go back and apologize to Master Jugo Liang. That certainly went easily. Well done. You have the heart of a warrior. out rather nicely you've proven to be a very talented fighter yes. master Sao Pi is not fit to be Emperor we shall never permit such tyranny he is an Emperor who ignores bandits attacking the people. Truly worthy of the title.
Master Sa is an emperor. Oh, you defeated some bandits. And that makes you worthy to be Emperor, does it? The Emperor must see all. Does he know these beasts pillage his fields?
It is time to take the attack to the enemy. Forward! There are beasts going wild in our fields! Someone help us! So much. You saved us. I have seen your love for your people. Please, forgive any past slights. I have to accept you now. I will go along with whatever the Emperor decides. Things turned out rather nicely. A truly amazing performance. You don't need me around. So, have you dealt with the people who stood in my way? It seems we have won over the Emperor's loyal supporters. That is one less thing for us to worry about. We have driven off the Shu spies. Thank you, everyone. I am impressed with your efforts. We have eliminated the Emperor's supporters that opposed my ascension. This will show the land how foolish it is to stand against me. Now, there are none left to oppose me taking the throne. At last, we can guide the land on a course towards peace and prosperity. Liu Bei has taken the mantle of Shu Emperor, and it seems he wasted little time in attacking Wu. How could he do such a thing? There is already a Wei Emperor, who was chosen by the former Han Emperor. Not only that, but he immediately went to war after naming himself Emperor. And it is not the Wei Emperor he acts against, but Wu. Liu Bei is driven by rage following the death of Guan Yu and seeks vengeance. Huh. I can understand the sentiment. Master Cao Pi, 
no, I mean, your Imperial Highness. There's no need to be so formal, Chiu. So Shu has attacked Wu. I have a feeling Liu Bei will suffer a massive defeat in this battle. Hmm. What makes you think that? Their formation indicates they are following the topography of Yi Ling and are stretched pretty thin. A well-placed strike will divide their ranks. They must not have Zhuge Liang with them. Either that, or Liu Bei is not listening to his advice. He is so consumed with rage, he does not realize the danger he is putting his men in. How tragic. That's rather unfortunate for them, but it presents a great opportunity for us. Prepare to march. This is our chance to finish off Shu for good. W wait my lord! You are emperor now! We cannot allow you to put yourself in harm's way like this! Hmm... You presume to tell your emperor what to do? I... I would never be so bold! I must apologize for speaking out of turn in such a way! No, think nothing of it. You were merely concerned for my safety. I do not blame you for that. However, a country with an emperor who only sits on his throne is destined to fail. This is my chance to show our superiority over our Han predecessor. Your Highness, allow me to offer my congratulations. <laughs> there is no need to suddenly be so formal. Huh. Sima Yi, tell me something. Why was Father... Why was Tao Tao only King of Wei? If he had only desired it, he could have taken the throne. Lord Cao Cao's main purpose was to restore order to the land. I believe he believed that by restoring and protecting the Han court, he was simply acting upon the best strategy to do exactly that. Hmm. Even though it had been on the verge of corruption, he sought the peace he knew, rather than an unknown possibility. And that was simply a display of human nature. Hmm. An excellent answer, Sima Yi. Thanks to you, I am once again convinced of the path I have chosen. I will not look to anyone else anymore.
I will not bend to anyone. I will change this land with my own hands. The grand rule of Zhao Wei starts now! The Shu forces suffered a massive defeat at Yiling, and Liu Bei has retreated to Beidi Castle. We should mobilize our army and attack them from five directions in order to ensure that Shu is finally annihilated. Five directions? That is a massive undertaking. Furthermore, in addition to our war against Shu, I propose we move the capital to Luoyang. It will be more efficient in terms of communications and supplies. Very well. I shall place you in charge of our efforts to defeat Xu and transfer the capital, Sima Yi. As you command, my lord. I want you to head for Ji Ting and await further orders. I can see the reason for attacking Shu and moving the capital. However, why does His Highness simply do what Master Sima Yi says? I have a feeling that soon, Wei will be completely under Master Sima Yi's control. We must begin our assault on Shu. Sima Yi, I want a status report and details of your strategy. Yes, my lord. Since Liu Bei's death, Shu has been guided by Zhuge Liang. But we have received word that he has fallen ill. Additionally, there is little public support for Liu Bei's heir, Liu Shen leading to discontent amongst the people. So, basically, Shu is facing serious internal problems right now. If we attack them from five different directions, we can annihilate them for good. The first army shall be our main unit, led by our lord. He will be followed by armies from Meng Huo of Nanjong, the Qiang and the Meng De of the Xiangyang. The fifth and final army will belong to Wu. Master Sima Yi, will Sun Quan really assist us in this battle? Will he not fear that the elimination of Shu would mean that Wu is next? I imagine he will, Wu Huai. That makes our elimination of Shu the perfect opportunity to ascertain Wu's thinking as well. We can learn much from how he responds to our requests. I am curious to see which way he leads. Oh, I see. You think of everything, Master Sima Yi. Then I must go and make my preparations for the battle.
If we can rid ourselves of Shu, I imagine Sima Yi will become even more powerful than before. I have a feeling our position here could be in danger. Is there anything we can do about it? It's simple. We'll just pretend we are ill and cannot send out our soldiers. Somebody needs to teach him that he can't always get what he wants. With Liu Bei gone, this is our best chance to finish... ...of Shu for good. Sima Yi, your intellect will prove vital towards that end. As you command, our target is Shengdu. Surround it from five directions at once and it will soon fall. What can a man like that do? I intend to watch him fail. It will be ex- All right. Lord Cao Pi is now Emperor of Wei. Your hard work allowed that to happen. You can realize the world ruled by Wei. We will support you with all we've got. Wei has gained a sense of stability under the new Emperor. It seems our efforts to deal with our internal troubles were time well spent. Hmm. Thanks to you, we can now turn our attention outwards. Our sole focus should be on eliminating Xu. Defensive positions! Liu <laughs> Kai, you should join Wei too. There's no future in Shu without Master Liu Bei. But I am honor bound to repay my debt to Master Liu Bei. While I stand, I will allow no rebellion to go unpunished. Honor is a fine thing, but I believe the definition of honor changes according to one's circumstances. We failed to stop the uprising. What will happen to shoot now? By one so dishonorable. This is a disgrace. Forgive me, Master Liu Bei. Glad we can reach an agreement. Now let's make Nanjong our ally. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Good work. You have made me proud.
Beidou Castle lies along the path who will need to send their reinforcements. I would like to take it without too many casualties. You're getting a bit too cocky, if you ask me. We won't be handing this place over to you that easily. We have to seize this place and make our preparations. Not least to work out what it is that U really wants. We are here to reinforce you. Let us defend Beatty Castle together. Let's do this with a smile. We cannot afford to lose this position. I shall personally see to its defense. I couldn't keep the castle safe. I don't think I'll ever be a match for my father or my brother. That certainly went easily. A tremendous display of might and bravery. Face me in battle. That certainly went easily. I knew you were good, but not this good. I so wanted to show Guan Swirl what I could do. Sorry. I cannot afford to lose this position. I shall personally see to its defense. Great as always! There was no need for my strategy! Are you prepared to face the daughter of the God of War? We cannot afford to lose this position! I shall personally see to its defense! Certainly went easily. A tremendous display of might and bravery. Why must I be so weak? Why can't I be more like my father and my brother? Okay, I've managed to secure a path for our advance. Now we just need to wait for the U army to arrive. Report! Who reinforcements have arrived! The reinforcements are much smaller than I was expecting. I suppose it reveals Boo's true attitude towards the situation. Enjoy this moment in the sun. I knew you were good.
We have orders to agitate Meng Huo, correct? Everything is ready. Let's head for Jianning at once. Will you provide some protection? Officer of Shu! Someone help me! I kill deserters! Stay here! Defend! Quite a spectacle. <laughs> Truly amazing. Certainly went easily. My king, Shu will soon attack Nongzhong. Should we join with the way? So, Shu, you got it. That's it. They'll soon learn what it means to make an enemy of me. That's the way, my dear. We have to keep our family safe. Things turned out rather nicely. Well, I'll be. But I didn't know you had it in you.
defensive positions. The will of Master Liu Bei lives on within Lord Liu Shan. In our land of virtue, I will fight! I have dedicated my life to my lord and Lord Cao Pi. I fight in service of the Cao family and all that it stands for. Let's do this with a smile. Wow, you're better than I thought. I have failed to keep Yunping Gate safe. Lord Yushan, please forgive me. That certainly went easily. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Truly impressive! I won't have any enemies left to defeat. You are shining brightly as a result of your efforts out there. of Shu safe. That is the legacy I inherited from my father. I see this will be more difficult than I thought. However, I will not back down, no matter how much resistance I face. Mr. Menchong, are you alright? I am here to assist you. to defend this area. Easily. Well done. You have the heart of a warrior. Kingdoms. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. That certainly went easily. Yes. Brilliant. I let the Wei army get by me. I'm so sorry, everyone. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. 
You've proven to be a very talented fighter. As you can see, I'm feeling pretty unwell. I can't lead troops like this. Sorry, but please just let me rest. You think I'm feigning illness? I'm sorry, but please... What? I can't lead troops. Medicine. Thank you. You want to watch me drink? Could this be... Poor... Ah! You know what? Fear not... Things turned out rather nicely. Truly impressive! I won't have any enemies left to defeat!
Squad. Wayne is joining with the Cheng. Stop it. <laughs> Here. Don't let them reach the Chiang. There you are, Wei Dogs. The Prime Minister saw this move coming. Jang, stop it! There are way officers here. Don't let them reach the Chiang. There you are, Way Dogs. The Prime Minister saw this move coming. Just as the Prime Minister thought, Way is joining with the Cheng. Stop it! Messenger from the way You want us to send reinforcements. You're willing to pay this much? Things turned out rather nicely.
today's grand ambition lives on in the hearts of all of us, I swear that we will build a land of virtue and benevolence. Pichau! At last we meet. Now to drag you into the endless pit of darkness that has haunted me since our last meeting. of Shu, I will stand firm against any and every opponent. <laughs> but looks like we got ourselves a troublemaker. I'll take care of this. I cannot let you interfere with Lady Wong. I shall deal with you personally. I wonder if Lady Wong Yi is okay. I should go and check on her. We need to hang in there. It is always easier to fight your way out of trouble. This battle is taking a turn for the worse. We must be careful. We cannot afford to lose this position. I shall personally see to its defense. support the future of Shu. Machao, how is it that you are always able to escape my grasp? Is my nightmare destined to continue for eternity? That certainly went easily. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Your bravery shall inspire poets to write of your deeds for generations to come. In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. Please, you must retreat. It will be in your own best interests. Who reinforcements? Reach Chengdu. But there aren't many of them. Hmm. Who's true intentions have revealed themselves? They're likely to join forces with Xu once more before long. Seems 
So we've discovered Booth's true intent. So what? With those numbers, information will make no difference. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. everyone to defend this area. Although I am not the most worthy of opponents, I would hope you are willing to look past that. I knew you were good, but not this good. positions. I suppose I always expected that this might happen. That certainly went easily. In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. I was forced to waste time dealing with our own incompetence. But Shu without Zhuge Liang is nothing to fear. So you're Liu Bei's son. I did not expect to see the Emperor of Wei come all this way himself. It must have been most inconvenient for you. Shuge Liang has something he would like to say to you. I hope you will grant him an audience. What? Did you say Zhuge Liang? I thought he was supposed to be sick. 
We will never surrender to Wei. If you desire to face us in battle, we will be more than ready. But when you do, I advise you to keep an eye out behind you. Now, if you'll excuse me, I will see you on the battlefield. From the rear, could Zhuge Liang have made a deal with Wu? All of our units are currently engaged with the Shu forces. We would be unable to defend against a Wu attack from behind. Oh, this is also due to my late arrival at Chengdu. There is no excuse for my failure, my lord. This is not your fault, Sima Yi. If everybody had properly carried out your orders, Shu would be nothing more than a distant memory. Besides, the Shu are not the only ones feeling pain right now. You and I both have our own issues to deal with. Yes, my lord. No matter. Although we did not manage to eliminate Shu, at least we now know Wu's true intentions. All units, prepare to march. We must return to the capital at once. Are you going to break off your alliance with Wu? Of course. Now that we have achieved our common purpose in defeating Huan Yu, I'm sure that Wu has already started planning their attack on us. We know that Wu has once again formed an alliance with Shu. It is likely that we are going to find ourselves under attack from both of them very soon. But this alliance was made only so that they may face us, their common enemy. In other words, their alliance is nothing more than a temporary expediency. Then given that reason, you're saying that we should attack them before they even have a chance to betray us. That's not true, Sima Yi. Judgment is merely something that casts light on reason. It's when you involve worthless feelings that people start thinking whether to betray or not. I am very impressed. There is no reason for us to ally ourselves with anyone at all. We will thoroughly destroy Wu and Shu, and we will end the chaos! Master Cao Pi, Wu has built a wall that spans several hundred leagues along the Shangjiang. Hmm, that sounds like quite a sight. I'll give it to Wu. They sure know how to make an impression. It seems they also possess talented men who can help in their efforts to conquer the land. It may be difficult to launch an attack on them now. I'm not sure. Although Wu won the Battle of Ealing, their strength is probably at a low right now. 
As such, it's highly unlikely they managed to build these walls in such a short amount of time. I see. There must be some secret behind them. However, no matter what, it is clear that U is not to be underestimated. I fought in battle with the men of U at Perfe, and found them all to be honorable warriors, both intelligent and brave. It is just as you say, my lord. The true threat of U lies in the personnel it has managed to assemble. As such, we must strive to match them in both wisdom and valor. Let us go forth and display the talent that the forces of Wei possess! Who is weak after its fight with you? This is our best chance to finally bring an end to those meddling fools for good. Let's go! Now is the time to attack! There are many weapons at Guan Ling. I want to send engineers to destroy them. But I need materials to make tools. Will you collect everything I need? rather nicely. You know, you actually possess a modicum of talent. The enemy is going to attack us here! Everyone prepare to defend this spot! What are you sniffing about at? I'll defeat you here! Oh, what interference is this? Is there some secret about those castle walls? I'm happy to find such a worthy opponent. I shall deal with that one myself. Strong enough! Retreating! Oh. I wondered what would happen for a moment there. Thank you. There's a secret to those walls. We need to infiltrate Jian Ye to find it out. Take this letter to the pier in the east, and then we can cross to Jian Ye. That certainly went easily. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. You performed great as always! There was no need for my strategy!
everyone to defend this area. Good. Good. We've stolen what we came for. Retreat before the wave forces find us. Materials from Perfe have been stolen by the U forces. We need to recover them quickly. Escape. Hurry and deliver these supplies. Just a little more and we can retreat. Everyone, hurry with those supplies. I'd better fall back before things get out of hand. That certainly went easily. Well done. You have the heart of a warrior. My fire attacks never fail. How could such a thing happen? Fire attack unit found close to John Ye. Lady One E is going on ahead. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Yes. Brilliant work. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. Kingdoms. whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. I've taken control of this territory. All right. I need everyone to defend this area.
I've taken control of this territory. Everyone to defend this area. Tori. Position. I shall personally see to its defense. In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. Defend it with our lives! <laughs> this moment in the sun.
That's a letter from Master Leo Yek. I hate to ask for something in return, but maybe you could help me out. I need gene herbs. Find them at Molin Fort. Whatsoever. At times I find myself envious of your strength. I've taken control of this territory. Hey, I wasn't expecting any visitors here. Whatever you're selling, I'm most definitely not buying. Now get lost. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. All right. We have to defend this place with our lives. You got me? I'm of no use to anybody dead. I'd better fall back for now. That certainly went easily. Save my friend. While you were collecting the herbs, I saw a huge Ufors headed for Jian Ye. I heard fighting started in Guanli, so why send so many troops to Jian Ye? Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Your bravery shall inspire poets to write of your deeds for generations to come. Crush 
the enemy! Show them no mercy! We shall defend this position. Do not allow a single enemy through. Now, take defensive positions! this moment in the sun. Oh, very well done. It's kind of cute seeing you in action. Wow, you're better than I thought. Very talented fighter. Let's go! Now is the time to attack! I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Nobody is allowed to enter Jiani without our Lord's permission. There's something strange about their behavior. We need to take action if we're going to find out what they're up to. You have no need to know. This is where you die. The enemy is quite strong. We should use our siege weapons against them. display of might and bravery.
failed to protect Yan Yi. How disappointing. That certainly went easily. In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. Let's do this with a smile! Some excellent fighting. How could my tactics fail like that? That certainly went easily. Such a fine display of the martial arts. Feel like that. That certainly went easily. A tremendous display of might and bravery. Plain to see that you are a true warrior of the Three Kingdoms. Let's go! Now is the time to attack! Certainly went easily. I'm deadly serious. In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. We'll be better off once we can capture that position. It must be captured at once. We'll be better off once we can capture that position. It must be captured at once! Control of this territory. This place is key to preventing the way invasion. We must not give it up. Let's 
Go! Now is the time to attack! Must use the weapons! Supplies deep in the base. Let's send these supplies to Guangli. Form up a transport unit at once. Come on. Show me how you big, strong men can fight. Attack. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Proven to be a very talented fighter. That certainly went easily. Wow, you're better than I thought. We'll be better off once we can capture that position. It must be captured at once!
Let's do this with a smile. We'll be better off once we can capture that position. It must be captured at once. My task was to protect Johnny, and I failed. Please forgive me, Lord Sun Chuan. Report! We checked behind the walls at Jun Ye. They are purely fabricated. It was a bold move of Buddha to threaten us with this fake castle. We must have a strategist of uncommon intellect among the knights. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. A tremendous display of might and bravery. the enemy. I won't let anyone thwart our advance. Wow, you're better than I thought. Taking control of this territory. Let's go. Now is the time to attack. Looks like the Wei Army's up to their same old tricks. Watch them tremble before our castle walls. So they built a long and winding wall along the far bank of the Shangjiang. It doesn't make any sense. Where did they find the time? Now! Activate the siege weapons! We can use them to push back the Wei forces! <laughs> I've done a little work on the weapons of the U forces. Report! The weapons have stopped. The enemy has interfered with them. The way forces are quite formidable to be able to overcome this move. Report from the John Ye attack unit. The castle walls are fake, fabricated. I had a feeling that was what they were up to. It was clearly a trick designed to keep us on the defensive. We have seen through Ooze's petty little trick. Now we can begin our advance on their main camp in earnest. Fire the bows from our castle walls! Do not let any of them near the main camp! What? A rain of arrows from the castle walls? We can't get close like this! grown in intensity. We learned the truth about our walls in short order. The enemy has realized the walls are fake. We can't hope to fight them all. Yin Feng's 
fire attack unit should be arriving in a moment now. If successful, it should be back to the army. We have captured Wu's garrison. Transferring its supplies to Wan Ling should boost morale there considerably. Let's do this with a smile. Floating Fawn is defeated. The fire attack unit is immobilized. What? Ding Fong has been defeated. We're counting on that fire attack. It seems I'm destined to lose yet another home. I failed myself and our people. I have conquered Guan Ling. Finally, Wu shall draw its last labored breath. Reporting! The supply unit has arrived! Yes! The supplies are here! Even better that we stole them from Wu. We must withdraw, Sima Yi. Although we were victorious, we have incurred heavy losses. It will be difficult to continue our advance. As you command, my lord. Uh. My lord? I remember my father also once faced a rapid decline in his health. It seems that the effort required to change the world can take quite a toll on one's body. You have constantly been on the move ever since losing your father. I think that you should rest for a while. <laughs> I would very much like to. I have not been able to spend much time with you lately. Let us fall back to Luo Yong for now. Jen. Yes, my lord. We shall defend this position. Do not allow a single enemy through. Well done. It's kind of cute seeing you in action. <laughs> <laughs> 